Known as Camazots, he was a literal Mesoamerican Batman. Could this infamous bat-like creature, like that of Quetzalcoatl, have ignited a flame within modern artists who have subsequently brought this ancient character into the mainstream? There are many things which we feel prove that these sites, and indeed the religions which grew within, were left by a now lost civilization. We have shared not only personal knowledge by substantial scientific study which now contradicts the history books. We have LIDAR, which demonstrates a complex, advanced society, one which had a past population of over 10 million. This is yet further proven by the ghost population hypothesis, or indeed the Graham-Hancock conclusion of mass amnesia from a global cataclysm, which once decimated a world population which would explain the lack of humans and other modern-esque life forms, which according to natural population growth patterns have substantial members missing from modern records. Tikal which seemingly survived incidents that killed off a population capable of predicting such events, along with eclipses via their stone clocks, possibly deciphering these sequences, and thus retaining an authority of divinity. Stolen plaques, which not only illustrated volcanic Armageddon, but also a great flood which they seemingly survived. The fact that these ancient sites contain pyramids, along with ancient technologies we still can't explain, with pools of mercury discovered beneath some of these sites adorned with ancient sports fields, which although sitting in dense jungle, has resisted the erosion from possibly millennia of nature, all suggesting that these sites were indeed built and left by a now lost yet once global super-civilization. According to ancient origins, quote, Camazots, meaning death bat in the Keish Mayan language of Guatemala, originated deep in Mesoamerican mythology as a dangerous, cave-dwelling bat creature. A cult following for the creature began amongst the Zapotec Indians of Oaxaca, Mexico, and the figure was later adopted into the pantheon of the Maya Quiche tribe and the legends of the bat god were later recorded in Maya literature. It continues. In the Maya culture, the bat god Camazots is linked to death. Camazots is also the name of a monstrous creature which inhabited a cave called the House of Bats in the Popolvu. Most scholars believe that Camazots was inspired by the common vampire bat, but others have suggested that it was based on a giant vampire bat that probably went extinct sometime during the Pleistocene or Holocene periods." End quote. What do you think about the Mesoamerican Batman? A more recently attached myth of a much later civilization ruins? Possibly a true character of a lost world? Or an intrinsic feature of Mesoamerican ruins? We find such ancient characters highly compelling. <laughs>